Hey everyone, Aninda here and this is an installation video of S5 port ROM on my Galaxy Grand 2. So S5 port ROM has been developed by Bali Boxer, the famous developer of Galaxy Grand 1 and 2. So uh, on this video I'll be showing you how to install this ROM and I'll make another video showing the ROM review as well. I know I'm pretty late on this video as I was on Jelly Bean 4.3. Very recently I switched to KitKat. So it's time to make some videos and uh, many of you asked me to make this video and also some other ROM reviews. So let's get on with that. This is the official, this is the official ROM uh, page on XDA and this is the download link. I'll provide that official link and also the download link on the video description from where you can download the ROM itself. On, and I suppose that you have already rooted your phone uh, if not then uh, follow the routing guide which I posted on my video on how to root Android version 4.4.2 on your Galaxy Grand 2 so, uh, and I will also add that uh, video link on the video description as well so that it might help and I suppose you have uh, already rooted your phone and you have uh, Android I mean uh, CWM recovery as your primary recovery and after downloading of that ROM, copy that uh, zip file to the phone's external memory card and uh, we'll continue. As you can see, that. I've already installed that ROM and uh, the Wi Fi and all is working fine. So, let me show you how I did that. And uh, so first up, I will go to the recovery mode. So, volume up, home, and power. Yeah. So, we are in CWM recovery. And first things first, if you are coming from a stock ROM, then it's always a uh, good idea to back up that rom to back up that rom come to come down to this backup and restore using the power button go there and uh, select this backup to external hg or backup to hg card so that will back up the whole uh, current rom which you are using on your phone right now and, uh, and then what you want to do is do a vibrate factory reset After that, do a uh, wipe cache. Next, you want to select this install zip. Hit the power button to select. Uh, choose the location. I have uh, kept the file in external SD. So, this is the file. It's called uh, S5 port version 3.zip. Select that file and uh, hit the power button and says like install yes hit the power button once again and it will automatically start the aroma installer just wait for it and uh, select your language then uh, next agree the terms and conditions next rom will install automatically it will take around uh, three to five minutes so I'll pause the video for now. Okay guys, now the installation is completed and uh, it says like, please reboot, we'll select next. Don't reboot your uh, phone now, we'll need to do one last step, uh, click on finish. Okay, next what you wanna do is uh, select install zip, select the location, external SD, and from here flash this 4.4 version dead kernel, 4.4 version 2.0 dead kernel. I'll tell you why uh, and the select yes will flash the dates kernel as because uh, if you don't flash the dates kernel then the Wi-Fi will not work on gen next uh, s5 port ROM so that's why we need to flash that uh, dates kernel now restart your phone and we'll select fix root so guys just now after five minutes or so the ROM booted up and uh, we are greeted with this language selection menu we'll select english united states and as you can see uh, wi-fi is working fine on this dates kernel so that's it for this video guys it's a quick video on showing how to install s5 port rom on your samsung galaxy grand 2 and i'll provide all the link on the video description so if any one of you interested in uh, flashing this ROM you can get those links from the video description and as you can see Wi-Fi is working fine so that's it for this quick video guys if you like this video then please click on like button 
and thanks for watching this is on indo take care